Hey everyone, it's Lauren Turner from Lauren Loves It. I'm a certified film critic and a broadcast journalist. Today, my video is going to be a little more personal. I'm not just gonna talk about a movie, but my personal connection to the movie. The United States versus Billie Holiday uh, is streaming on Hulu right now. It is a really, really well put together film. Uh, Andrew Day, who has been vocal about kind of being afraid to take this role because she's not an actress, she's a singer. Well, she does a phenomenal job. She's gonna win, she's gonna win so many awards. She's already, it's award season, she's already winning awards. Congratulations to her and Lee Daniels and everyone because this was a really good movie. Um, it wasn't as good as Lady Sings the Blues, that classic Diana Ross portrayal of Billie Holiday, but I, my kudos to the entire team. So why is this film personal to me? Well, there is a character or a person in the movie, Tallulah Bankhead. She's portrayed by Natasha Leon, who does a good job. Tallulah Bankhead is one of my family members. Um, according to Ancestry DNA, she's like my great, great, great aunt. I grew up hearing stories about Tallulah. My grandmother knew her and this picture actually right here is my grandmother as a baby with Tallulah holding her. And that's one of Tallulah's many, many travels to Detroit to see her family. So Tallulah Bankhead was a silent film star, a theater star, Broadway. Um, she was super famous in her time. She has a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame and Unfortunately, I feel like she was more famous for her hijinks and for her affairs, if you will. And one of those affairs was with Billie Holiday. So, I mean, think about this. It's an interracial and same gender affair during a time where none of that was accepted. And the United States versus Billie Holiday, they touch on it a little bit in the hotel, which is a really good scene in the hotel, the elevator scene. Tallulah was someone that I grew up you know, you hear these stories about her. I wondered about like, why is she, like how are we connected? And it's so interesting because recently I have been doing a lot of research and it's crazy how much my family that I grew up with and knowing in, in Detroit is connected to Tallulah. Um, there's a book I just found that was written in the 70s where it talks about how she, there were the black bank heads and the white bank heads and the white bank heads stayed in Alabama, but the black bank heads moved to Detroit. Side note, the movie Roots, there's a scene where they say, the bank heads are going up north. Well, that's my family, the bank heads. Um, and they moved to Detroit and Chicago, the Northern states. But Tallulah would make sure to come to Detroit and visit her family here. And she was never opposed to admitting that, you know, her, the descendants of the Bankheads were slaves, some of them, and were the product of masters and slaves procreating, and most times not by choice. And so I commend Tallulah and my family for, you know, embracing us, embracing every part of who they are. I've always wondered why there's there hasn't been a film or a TV series about Tallulah Bankhead. And uh, can I copyright that right now? Like I'm copywriting it. I wanna be a part of it in some kind of way. <laughs> I got access to the, the juicy stuff. This is Women's History Month, it's March. And I think that this is a wonderful woman to highlight during Women's History Month because during a time when women were not outspoken, she was. And a time where women kind of kept to themselves, especially women in the public eye. Uh, let me tell you, Tallulah wrote a letter to Jagger Hoover uh, about Billie Holiday. You know, she didn't care that this could ruin her career by standing up for what she believed in. She was flawed. And that's another message for women because we're all flawed. and. You know, with Instagram and all these things, these days we're trying to portray this perfection and it's kind of a breath of fresh air for me to know that I have a family member who paved the way in her own way of, of showing that women were more than just a pretty face. 
I am very, very grateful that Tallulah Bankhead is someone I can say is a part of me. So what did you think about the United States versus Billie Holiday? And do you want to hear more personal stories about Tallulah Bankhead? Because I have a lot, but I'm kind of holding on to them. I got to ask my grandma, is it okay to like air this stuff? Comment below and let me know. And don't forget to watch The United States versus Billie Holiday, now streaming on Hulu.